so like I said, uh, what I want to talk about today is how to go to heaven when you die. Amen? Amen. I'm going to read this first verse to you. It says, These things have I written unto you that believe on the name of the Son of God, that ye may know that ye have eternal life, and that ye may believe on the name of the Son of God. Now, yes. It means you, like Kamu in Messiah. Okay. So right here, the Bible says that you can know that you're going to heaven. And makin the balo kamu pinali sa patu sa anak sa Dios. Kinsa ang anak sa Dios ni kinsa lagi? Jesus. Jesus. Amen. Yes. Alright. So going to heaven is as easy as believing in Jesus. Mituba kamu ni Jesus. Yes. Pero nai na kalain lain kinuhan ba kini kang Jesus? mga Protestante, Catholico, Mormon, sa kini Jehovah, Iglesia ni Cristo. But I want to teach you what you must believe about Jesus to go to heaven. Okay? Now, the first thing you must understand about Jesus in the gospel <coughs> is the Bible says, as it is written, there is none righteous, no, not one. So, while I be sunny to that power, not perfecto. Do you think perfecto? How much more perfecto? Yeah. Now, Rasong, kita dili perfecto. The Bible says, For all have sinned and come short of the glory of God. Exactly. Have you lied before? Everyone's lied. Right. Now, God loves us, even though we're sinners. But God is a righteous God, and God is a holy God, and He is a just God. So, nai silo parasa atong mangasala. There's a punishment for our sins. And this is the bad news first. Are you ready for the bad news? Yes. Okay. The Bible says, but the fearful, and unbelieving, and the abominable, and murderers, and whoremongers, and sorcerers, and idolaters, and all liars shall have their part in the lake which burneth with fire and brimstone, which is the second death. Now, unsaan ikaduha ang nakamatay? Lani or Daryl? Daryl, di ba? Ang chukano sa kamanang ni Daryl, temporaryo, ang kutsaan ko. Ang kutsaan ko. In the Philippines, people say walay forever, right? Like your Buya breaks up with you. Pero ang Biblia says hell is forever. Gusto ba ka mong pangatun sa hell? No! Now, dili ka na nakapatay, di ba? Dili ka na naparlaman ka, di ba? Pero na pil usag ang kanang patako. The Bible even says all liars deserve hell. So I've lied, you've lied. Mau ni ang dili maang balita. Do you understand the bad news? Yes. But God loves us, right? Yes. Amen. Amen. So the Bible says, "For the wages of sin is death, but the gift of God is eternal life through Jesus Christ our Lord." Now, who is Jesus? Who is Jesus? The Father. He's, he's the Son, the Messiah, but he is also God. Right? We true ba kamu ng si Jesus Dios? Yes. Right? Kusa ka Dios tulo ka persona ng mahan anak Espiritu Santo. So si Jesus Dios ng anak pa kita mo. Right? Jesus warns us of many false gods. He more he warns us of many false Jesuses. But the real Jesus, he is God. Amen. Amen. Now Jesus showed many signs and many miracles to prove that he was the Messiah. Si Agianak ni Berhing Maria. Yang di abu kang mga pinulai, yang di pakau kang dagang pakau pan, yang di bantau ang patay. But the most significant thing that Jesus did, si Jesus na kinabuti ng walasala. Jesus never sinned. He never lied. He never murdered. He never stole. Jesus is perfect because Jesus is God. Amen. 
Amen. Now, what happened to Jesus? How did he die? Did he get cancer? Jesus died in the cross. Right. cruz. And the Bible says on the cross, like Amanda in heaven took the sins, my salam, of the Kalimutan, and placed them on Jesus. All of my sins, all of your sins, the sins of the past, the present, and even the future, they were placed on Jesus. And because he died with our sins on Halakni Jesus in Piano for three days and three nights, Jesus went to hell in our place with our sins for three days and three nights on Halakni Jesus. But what happened after three days and three nights? My house, yeah, amen? amen. Right. He showed the nails in his hands. He showed his bleeding side. And then he walked on this earth for 40 days and 40 nights. But even though Jesus did that, and I know that's not popular to say. You know, most churches or pastors or priests, they just like to say everybody goes to heaven. But that's not what Jesus said. Jesus said, straight is the gate and narrow is the way which leadeth unto life. And few there be that find it. Uh, very few people go to heaven. It's very easy to go to heaven. And we can look at this other verse here. It says, for by grace are ye saved through faith, and that not of yourselves, it is the gift of God, not of works, lest any man should boast. And the reason why most people go to hell is because they try to get to heaven by works. This is what every false religion teaches you have to do to go to heaven. You don't have time. You gotta go to church, you gotta get baptized, you gotta repent of your sins. That's not how you go to heaven. And let me explain this further. <laughs> Do you know John 3.16? Yes! It right, says the same thing. For God so loved the world that he gave his only begotten Son, that whosoever believeth in him should not perish, but have everlasting life. So I'm going to ask you 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 I tell Wasan, whosoever believeth in him should not perish but have everlasting life. So if you want to go to heaven, you don't have to go to my church. You don't have to go to any church. You don't have to be baptized. You don't have to repent of your sins. All you have to do is trust in Jesus by faith. And this is the really good news. Are you ready for the really good news? Yes. All right. Let's say I gave him my Bible, regalo. Did he pay for it or did I pay for it? I pay for it, right? So for him, I'm good to be a libre, right? Now, Kalawasan, So most people go to hell. With their mouth, they say they believe in Jesus. But with their heart, most people are trying to walk their way to heaven. They're trying to get to heaven by their own righteousness, by their own good works. But none of us are righteous. We are sinners, and we deserve hell. So the only way to heaven is to place our faith in what Jesus did and not in what we do. That's not done? Yeah. <laughs> now, I'm not saying to do bad things, okay? I'm not saying to skip church. I'm not saying to break the commandments. 
I'm not saying to steal or kill or commit suicide or anything like that. But I am saying, once you believe, once you're saved, you're saved forever. Jesus said, and I give unto them eternal life, and they shall never perish. Neither shall any man pluck them out of my hand. Once you believe, once you're saved, Jesus has you in his hand, and you can never go to hell. You can never lose your salvation. You cannot walk away from your salvation, because Jesus gives you what? Temporary or forever? Temporario or one who's a hundred? Right. Amen. Are you listening? Yes. Let's say someone thinks they can lose their salvation. Okay? If someone thinks they can lose their salvation, do they believe that Jesus gave them eternal life? No, because eternal life is forever. Right? If you think you can lose your salvation, if we're talking to Io, you're not saved because you're trusting in yourself. If you believe the gospel, if you trust in Jesus, you'll never go to hell. You'll never lose your salvation. You cannot lose it. It's a free gift. He says right here. It says right here, it's a gift, right? Jesus paid for the gift. You don't have to pay for it, okay? So, Gilico Perfecto, you're not perfect either, right? Yes. Yeah, right? So, this verse is how I or you or anybody can know that they're going to heaven. Because he says, if you believe in Jesus, and that's a Dios, you may know. That's not that no. Yes. To be certain, right? You may know that you have eternal life. Biblico perfecto, but I know I have eternal life because of Jesus. And the moment I believed, He washed away my past sins, my present sins, and even my future sins. Right? So I can never go to hell. I can't lose my salvation. Now God will punish us if we do wrong. Okay. He'll punish us in this life. If you commit murder, my priso. Amen? Amen? If you do manga droga, God by sin do terte sign your life. Amen? Amen. Right? If you drink alcohol, you're going to mess up your life. You're going to do stupid things. You're going to abuse people. But you still go to heaven. Because Jesus my Amen? Amen? Amen. Alright, so let me make sure you understand. Uh, who must you believe in? Jesus, right? And I'm not trying to offend anyone, but I have to say this. Have you heard this verse before? Jesus said, I am the way, the truth, and the life. No man cometh unto the Father. But by me. So, see, Jesus, Laman, I can't save you. You can't save yourself. Muhammad, Allah, Hebeloid. Okay, they can't save you. Jesus said, I am the way, the truth, and the life. Amen? Amen. It's in the Bible, John 14, 6. Now, once you believe in Jesus, how long does he save you for? Temporario or Hamdu Sahamdu? Right? Is Tila Kasala on the Bible and Jesus? Tila Raba or Kanan? Kanan. right? So, Paano Pumi Tul Nakika Jesus on the Adili Matu Baptismo? You believe in Jesus and you get saved, but you never get baptized. Like the thief on the cross, right? He believed in Jesus, he never got baptized. Did he go to hell or heaven? Heaven. Heaven, right? Because on Baptismo, what Matu was in you? Matu. Whosoever believeth in him should not perish but have everlasting life, right? <laughs> you believe in Jesus and you never go to church. God forbid, okay? You should go to church. But an extreme example you believe in Jesus and you never go to church. Amen? Amen. 
bahan bahan tuas ini untuk batu. Batu. Right. Paano kung may tura kay kang Jesus unya dili paliroso sa mga sala pero pagpuro kay Jesus pero ulangi ulangi right okay I've got a really hard question are you ready for this one yeah all right paano kung may tura kay kang Jesus unya dili itubo sa ginoo makapatay o makigo pero pagpuro kay Jesus pero ulangi ulangi Lagi, because pila kasala ang ibayaran ni Jesus, pipila raba o tanan. Tanan! Eternal life, temporaryo o hanggang sa hanggang? Hanggang sa hanggang. Okay, my hardest question, are you ready? Yes! Paano kung ito nakikang Jesus kung niya five years later, matuha-tuha? But you already believe and you already got saved kung niya five years later, matuha-tuha. Careful, lagi. Lagi. Lani, right? Here's why. The moment you believe in Jesus, how long does he save you for? Temporary or Exactly. So if you believe in Jesus, in that moment, that moment you believe, he saves your soul forever, and you're born again, you're saved forever. Even if you already got saved. Past tense, you're saved already, right? So do you want to ask me what Okay. Um, so that's the good news. Jesus kita Do you understand that? Yes. Do you believe he died for your sins? Yes. Do you believe in the Yes. Okay. Now I'm almost finished, but I've come to my point in my presentation where people like to play games, okay? Are you going to play games or are you going to be honest with me? Yeah. Honesty is the best policy, amen? Yeah. Yeah. That's what the little slogan says, right? So, before we talk, you are going to be honest, amen? Yeah. You probably thought this is how you go to heaven, Dibat. You know how time? Before I came, this is what you believe, right? Pero ang Biblia, patuloy kay Jesus, is how you go to heaven. That's not that? So, importante ka ayo. Salusa mo na papaluas. When should you believe this? Should you wait for 50 years? O karo? Salusa mo na papaluas. 50 years o karo? Karo! Gusto ba ninyo maluas karo? Yes! Temporary o ano sa hapun? Ano sa hapun? Now, last last thing. If you believe this with your heart, how would you tell Jesus that you believe? Nada ba cell phone on Dios? Nada. Nada ba Facebook Messenger on Dios? Nada. Nada ba walkie-talkie on Dios? Nada. No. How do you tell Jesus that you believe? You pray. You pray, right? So I'm going to say a prayer to Jesus. And if you believe this, you can repeat after me. And we'll tell Jesus that you believe the gospel and you'll go to heaven 100% sure when you die. That's not that? Yeah. All right. So if you believe, you can repeat after me. Um, okay. Uh, dear Jesus. Dear Jesus. I know I'm a sinner. I know I'm a sinner. I know I deserve hell. I know I deserve hell. But I believe. I you died for all my sins. You died for all my sins. And rose from the dead. And rose from the dead. Please save me. Please save me. Right now. Right now. Forever. Forever. Amen. Amen. Did you believe that? Yes. Where will you go when you die? In Pira Ulani. Because you have to explain this to them. That salvation is only by faith and it's not by good works. Okay? <laughs> but one last thing before I go here.
Now, I don't have enough of these for everybody, but I'm just going to leave some up here. Maybe you can take pictures of them on your cell phone. Uh, but this is just an invitation to my church if you ever want to come. It's called a Pillar Baptist Church in GSIS Heights. It's got our website on here. It's got my Facebook on here. And you do not have to go to my church to go to heaven, right? I've got a lot of Tiagi, the lot of right? But after you're saved, Jesus does want you to do good work. He wants you to go to church. He wants you to preach the gospel. But the first thing he wants you to do after you're saved is to get baptized, okay? A lot of people, they got sprinkled with water as a baby. A lot of people, they got baptized because they thought it was part of salvation. But in the Bible... A real baptism happens after you're saved. Someone in the Bible asked an apostle, What doth hinder me to be baptized? And he said, If thou believest with all thine heart, thou mayest. Okay? As a baby, you can't believe the gospel yet. And if you got baptized to be saved, then you did believe the gospel. Okay? But that's the next thing you should do. It's up to you. If you come to my church, we can help you with that. But I'm just going to leave a few of these up here. Does anyone have any questions? No. All right. Well, we can turn it on. It's a lot.